apologize for the lack of tutorials recently. It's just bridal season and everybody and their mama is getting married. So I've just been really busy getting brides ready. I will get back into the swing of things soon. And also recently, it was my birthday. Happy birthday, Shayna. Thank you. I got two gifts this year. Score. So for my birthday, one of my girlfriends actually got me this. It's a caviar manicure set. So if you can't put it in your mouth, put it on your nails, right? Yeah. And the other gift I got was a bag, Kinder Surprise, from some random guy off the streets who found out it was my birthday that night. So that was pretty awesome. This was the only one that's remaining, which I have not unwrapped. Stay tuned to find out what's inside the Kinder Surprise. So you better make sure you watch the entire tutorial, okay? Since I can't read, this is great for people like me. And if you can't read, this is great for people like you. So thank you, Caviar Manicure for providing us with a wonderful step-by-step -step picture guide. Alright, so let's get started. So first things first is take off any of your old nail polish, clear off those nail beds, and then apply a base coat. Well, I'd like to. It doesn't really say it on the directions, but I always do. Then we're going to take our Caviar Manicure nail set, and uh, what you want to start off with is this paint pot right here, and it's kind of like a sticky base coat. Make sure you put your plastic tray under your fingers before you start sprinkling. You want to take your Caviar Pearls and sprinkle it right on top of your nails, and then press down gently, like an up-down motion. You want to make sure you don't roll it around. Um, make sure it's nice and secure in there, because if you do start rolling it around, you're going to get glue on the outsides of the pearls, and you don't want to have that messy kind of muddy look. So go ahead and do the rest of it with your nails and you want to always make sure that you've got your tray underneath because you are going to save these beads and put them back into the jar after we're all done. So you know what, the base coat looks pretty streaky. Um, it doesn't really matter because it all gets covered up with the caviar beads. And technically you're supposed to apply one coat of the base coat, let it dry, apply a second coat of the base coat, and then that's what gives you the ideal finish. Either way, you know what, it doesn't really matter because these beads flake off like there's no tomorrow. Like I got them stuck all over the place. But anyways, that's what they look like. They look pretty nice, uh, very kind of classy, I guess. Lady gaga -ish, whatever. You want to take your funnel, Funnel your beads right back into your jar again because you can reuse these. So uh, that's why we use this little plastic tray because you don't want to waste any of your product. You know what? I think you could just use any type of dollar store beads. You don't really have to go and get this set. And if you use like a base coat that's uh, kind of sticky, I'm sure that would work as well. I mean, that's another tutorial to try out for another day. But there you go. That's my review. A lot of negatives, not too many positives. Not so good for a makeup artist because I know once I start doing makeup, obviously, like, I don't want to get beads in my client's eyes and I don't want anything to fall off. And again, if you eat curry, food that's going to stain your nails, it's going to look pretty nasty. Also, if you're doing your makeup, you accidentally get foundation on here, it's going to crease in into, like, the little beads. So you'll see that a lot of the beads start to flake off. And I got a bunch of beads stuck in my teeth and I just had to floss them out like a second ago and I think I cracked a tooth. Precautionary measures. Do not eat immediately after applying these. It's not like I was like trying to eat it or anything. I'm not an idiot. So a lot of downsides to this. Do not forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I will see y'all next time. Thank you for joining me once again for an awesome tutorial on Caviar Nails. What? Check out my new website and make sure to follow me on Facebook. I'm always looking for new models. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot. So here is the kind of surprise we were going to open. Let's go ahead and open this up. These are awesome. Um, they make my day. And if I had like a whole box of these, I would just be like happy forever. It's a chocolate egg that has like a prize inside. How amazing is that? Like who came up with this idea? Alrighty, what is it? Oh shit, it's a good one. Oh my god, it's a giraffe. It's like the best birthday gift. Sorry, Joyce. I love the nail polish. It's awesome. But man, I've been honestly waiting. Like this isn't even a joke. No joke. I've been waiting to get this giraffe for a long time. That's my giraffe. Oh my god. It's freaking amazing. Thanks, random guy on Davy. Best birthday gift ever. I got a bead in my eye. <laughs>